Hi there, Spark fans. Rob Reynolds here. About a year back, we brought you the OpenMV H7 camera, an amazing camera module with its own microcontroller to allow you to program it as a standalone device using high-level Python scripts. Now, this is great for simplifying things like complex outputs of machine vision algorithms and high-level data structures. But people wanted more. We wanted more. You wanted more. Well, OpenMV is giving us more. Introducing the new OpenMV H7 Plus. The OpenMV H7 camera is driven by an ARM Cortex M7 processor running at 480 megahertz with 32 megabytes of SRAM plus one megabyte of SRAM and 32 megabytes of external flash plus two megabytes of internal flash. All I.O. pins output 3.3 volts and are five volt tolerant. The processor has the following I.O. interfaces. A full speed USB interface to your computer. Your OpenMV cam will appear as a virtual COM port and a USB flash drive when plugged in. There's a micro SD card socket, which allows your OpenMV cam to take pictures and easily pull machine vision assets off of the micro SD card. A spy bus that can run up to 80 megabits per second, allowing you to easily stream image data off the system to either the LCD shield, the Wi-Fi shield, or another microcontroller. There's an I2C bus, a CAN bus, and an asynchronous serial bus for interfacing with other microcontrollers and sensors. A 12-bit ADC and a 12-bit DAC. Two I.O. pins for servo control interrupts and PWM on all of the board's 10 I.O. pins, and an RGB LED and two high-power 850 nanometer IR LEDs. There's 32 megabytes of external 32-bit SDRAM clocked at 100 megahertz, and 32 megabytes of external quad spy flash clocked at 100 megahertz. The removable camera module system allows the OpenMV Cam H7 Plus to interface with different sensors. And the OpenMV Cam H7 Plus comes with an OV5640 image sensor capable of taking five megapixel images. Most simple algorithms will run on 25 to 50 frames per second on QVGA resolutions and below. Your image sensor comes with a 2.8 millimeter lens on a standard M12 lens mount. If you want to use more specialized lenses with your image sensor, you can easily pick those up and attach them yourselves. And finally, there's a LiPo battery connector compatible with 3.7 volt LiPo batteries. Like its predecessor, the OpenMV H7 Plus is capable of amazing things. And with the added speed and memory on this board, you can do more than ever before with it. Of course, it has all the standard camera operations like video recording, image capture, and color tracking, but this will also do marker tracking, face detection, eye tracking. It will detect and decode linear barcodes, data matrix barcodes, QR codes, even April tags, which it can generate itself. And with somewhere in the neighborhood of 200 examples in the OpenMV IDE, you'll have more than enough to get you started in machine vision applications. Want to know who shows up at your door throughout the day? Try the snapshot on face detect script. Plus, all of the recently released add-ons, the Wi-Fi shield, the LCD shield, and all of the lens modules are fully compatible. So upgrade to the OpenMV H7 Plus camera today. Pick up yours over at sparkfun.com, and as always, stay safe, be kind, and happy hacking. Plus, all of the recent really, 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 really <laughs> full of amazing things. Why is that? Oh, yeah, more memory, more speed. How do I start? <laughs> oh, yeah. Plus, all of the recently released. <laughs> I think I'll switch that. Yeah. Uh, the Wi Fi shield, the LCD shield, and all of this lens. <laughs> I don't know if it's over 200, it's right around 200. But when I got up to like 180, I stopped counting. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, there's a bunch more. That's all right.